as a Westerner, we're always going to be the Westerner. But I do enjoy feeling a bit, at least a bit more, a bit more part of the culture, and I try and do it as much as possible. Sorry, hello. Is uh, is Mr. Is it, sorry? Are you Mr. English Rice? And I just think it's so funny that I reply. I go, yes, yes, I'm English Rice. Yes, and it's just a ridiculous name, but it's quite funny that. Uh, that's kind of stuck. Uh, when I was a kid, I always wanted to be on TV cooking. That was always my dream. I know my, my dad has always said to me, you've got to put yourself somewhere where you're different and where you're, you're special and people would want what you can offer. If I could try and use my Chinese and try and do it in China, that's somewhere where nobody's doing it. My idea when I started doing this, the, the tricycle selling hummus was I want to see people's reaction to uh, kind of uh, a different snack that they haven't tried before using local ingredients because then ultimately I want to open a restaurant. This is the stage of the restaurant at the moment. It's, uh, this will become a restaurant. <laughs> the restaurant will hopefully be uh, just down the side street of a friend of mine's uh, restaurant. I've known the, the owner of this restaurant for, for a few years now. Um, in our year abroad, I lived just over there, across the road, in the Hukong, just there, uh, in 2008. And uh, whenever we felt homesick and wanted a bit of Western food, we used to come here and uh, get some Italian food and stuff. And uh, yeah, we love this place. And uh, so, yeah, so we started to um, get to know the owner. And uh, well, I think a couple of months ago, he said, you know, there's some space behind our restaurant here that we're not using. Why don't we turn that into the restaurant? Um, and like we've always talked about working together. At some point, like it's going to be uh, interesting. The restaurant is from about, I think, from about here to about here. <laughs> <laughs> so this is going to be the front door. Yeah, yeah. I think we'll do some kind of sign up here, and like I think maybe what what I'm thinking is like open it up. And have like a window here or something. Because basically, I'm, I'm thinking because uh, it'll mainly be uh, takeaway stuff. I figure I don't want everybody have to come into the restaurant to line up to order because then there's not much space in there. So you wouldn't have any seats. Or? Yeah, there will be some seats. Um, the way I'm thinking is there'll be seats, maybe maybe 10 people, something like that, but it won't be big and then maybe have like an open kitchen with like a glass front or something. I want it to be fun. I don't, I'm not trying to make the world's, you know, five star restaurant with top cuisine at 1000 Kwai for a little bowl of pasta. I mean, if you do your own snacks and your own food creations, so you, people have nothing to compare it to. We left university and I just didn't want to go straight into a into an office job and do something like that. I think my parents probably would like me to, but I just I think while I'm still young, I'd regret it if I didn't try it. So. The way I see it as I'm 23 right now, and if I don't try it now. And I don't think you can ever be completely ready for it. I figure I should just go for it and see what happens.